Hi guys, Genevieve here with a quick video about entities in response to the video that I previously did. Um, some people have emailed me some questions. I often get a lot of people contacting me asking for help in this area. So demons, entities, possessions, that kind of thing. Uh, and sometimes they've tried to clear this stuff themselves and it hasn't worked. And for those people, one of the first questions I ask them is, are you sure it's the same entity? Because if you've got some sort of capacity with entities, so you can see them, you can perceive them, you know that they're there. Um, if you clear them, you may find that more come. So what if the entities that you're dealing with are different entities? So, and what would it take for you to be an allowance of the capacity that you have? Because unfortunately, if, you've, if you are aware of these things, that's not going to change. That's not going to go away. And if you try to shut it out, it actually will affect you negatively. So um, the reason being, our awareness is what gives us the power to not be affected by these things. So if you've got two people crossing the road, you've got one that can see, one that's blind, which one is more likely to get hit by a car? It's the same with entities. You're much less likely to be the effective entities or be controlled by them if you're willing to be aware of them and receive from them instead of make, making them wrong or making the fact that they're bothering you wrong. So one of the reasons why this happens is because of all of those scary Hollywood movies out there where entities, you know, it's this big, dramatic, terrible, they're, they're you know, nasty, nasty. Um, and so we get this idea in our head that that's what the spirit world, you know, if there's ghosts or entities um, coming to you, then that's that's what they're going to be like. And what if what if it's not like that at all? Okay, so if that's showing up for you, it, it can happen, um, but there there will be some sort of reason as to why it's happening to you. So. What is right about this situation I'm not getting, okay? You can just use the clearing statement, right on good, bad, on and pop shorts, boys and to clear any, any of the fear or anything that you have in order for you to start receiving what is right about it. Often, even if they seem like they're, they're creating, they're coming and bothering you, they're trying to be a gift in some way. So maybe they're trying to get you to own your capacities. Maybe they're trying to get you to use them. Maybe they're trying to get you to stand into like the potency and power of you. So maybe they're wanting you to step into that dominant vibration because if you're willing to be the dominant vibration, you can command that anything leave and it, and it will. So, I mean, this is your life, it's your reality, and you're the one with the body, so that gives you more power also, because they don't have bodies. Um, so, what would it take for you to start owning that? Um, now, the other thing with all of this uh, is, well, that which we resist persists. So, if you are finding that this is happening and it's not changing and it's not changing and it's not changing, um, what would it take for you to get out of resistance to what's happening? Lower your barriers and what can I receive from this entity? Uh, so, yeah, so do, 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 do. what else do I need to tell you? Oh yeah, so the other thing is with people that tend to email me, often they're struggling financially and there is a connection, okay? So if you're in resistance to receiving from entities, you have to create a wall in order to try and block them out, which means that you're cutting off from a huge part of you, which means that the universe can't contribute to you the same way that it would if you were in allowance of all of these energies. Um, because if you think about it, we are all infinite. We are all infinite energies. And if you take away the definition of anything, we would all just be one. So the universe doesn't really get when you create some sort of wall that you just want it to shut out the entities. It shuts out your receiving of everything, which means that it will affect your money flows. So if you want more money in your life, you may want to get into allowance of receiving from entities um, or being an allowance of them being here because they're everywhere, okay? So, uh, yeah. So if 
lastly, if, if you've tried to clear them yourself and they're not clearing, there is some sort of hidden gift, okay? There's some reason. So what is, what is, what would it take? Start asking questions. What would it take for these beings to get out of my house? What, what would I, ha what energy would I have to be in order to make that happen? And see what happens then. So I'm going to do a free clearing loop for those of you that are struggling and that can't afford for sessions that it should clear if it, whatever's going on if it doesn't guess what you're wanting it for some reason so if that happens if you use the clearing loop and it doesn't work you want to start asking the question what do I love about having entity attachments what do I love about having demons affecting me and destroying and create everything that is right on good bad on pop pop shorts poison me on and keep doing that and keep listening to the loop until things change um, you will be able to sign up to a link below join my mailing list and then you'll be able to get the loop okay and all you've got to do is play it in your house or wherever it is um, or any time that you feel that you've got some sort of attachments and yeah hopefully it's a contribution to you that's all from me today see you later